Hey, what up guys? It's your boy Mohammed here. And today, as you know, we are going to be going over the Arabic phrases in the Gulf and Emirati dialect. But before we get started, did you have to know that learning any languages intuitively, I mean, listening and speaking, listening and repeating, is one of the best and useful way to learn any languages. Then, without any further ado, let's get started. طالعين عندك شيء وين تصريحك طالعين عندك شيء وين تصريحك طالعين عندك شيء وين تصريحك ما يخصك من يوم ورايح يخصني ما يخصك من يوم ورايح يخصني ما يخصك من يوم ورايح يخصني Alright folks, the first dialect that we heard was طالعين عندك شي وين تصريحك وين تصريحك طالعين basically means we are going out and طالع is basically is the pattern of فاعل but this one طالعين is a plural one and طالع is a singular one but you could use this pattern I mean باب الفاعل in two function the one is for present tense present continuous tense that we see here and the next one is for past tense but in this context it's actually used for present tense طالعين, we are going out and عندك means you have عندك you have عندك عندك she do you have anything or do you have a thing and she means think and when تصريحك when means where and تصريح means permits or permission and تصريحك with attached pronouns it basically means your permits where is your permits or where is your permission but the second phrase was ما يخصك من يوم رايح يخصني ما يخصك basically is the expression and means it has nothing to do with you or it's not related to you and min yawm rayih and it basically means that from right now on yakhussni yakhussni means it's related to me yakhussni yakhussni with attached pronouns ya yakhussni it means it has something to do with me okay anti ma qarayti sultan shu kitab fil group akhouch mawjood fil group انت ما قريتي سلطان شو كتب في الجروب اخوك موجود في الجروب انت ما قريتي سلطان شو كتب في الجروب اخوك موجود في الجروب انت ما قريتي سلطان شو كتب في الجروب اخوك موجود في الجروب انت is a pronoun and means you and ما قريتي you didn't read it means you didn't read سلطان شو كتب Shu Kitab means what Sultan wrote. And Shu means what in Kitab is a past tense and means wrote. And if he's a preposition and means in, and a group means group, it's a telegram group. And a means your brother. Mujud, Mujud means present or exist for the group in the group. And Timagraiti, Sultan Shu Kitab for the group. A Khuch Mujud for the group. ليش ما تخلي مهدي تطلع من البيت؟ ليش ما تخلي مهدي تطلع من البيت؟ ليش ما تخلي مهدي تطلع من البيت؟ انت قلت اللي يطلع لازم تصريح الا ميثا ميثا يعني اخت فيصل انت قلت اللي يطلع لازم تصريح الا ميثا ميثا يعني اخت فيصل انت قلت اللي يطلع لازم تصريح الا ميثا ميثا يعني اخت فيصل Alright guys what we heard was ليش ما تخلي ميثا تطلع من البيت ليش ما تخلي ميثا تطلع من البيت ليش means why and تخلي means you let or the second meaning for تخلي means you put something to somewhere but in this context it means let ليش ما تخلي؟ Why you don't let ميثا تطلع 
تطلع means you go out من from البيت house ليش ما تخلي ميثا تطلع من البيت why you don't let ميثا to go out from house انت قلت لي يطلع لازم تصريح الا ميثا ميثا يعني اخت فيصل you told me انت is a pronoun and means you قلت لي told me قلت told and قلت لي you told me يطلع يطلع means going out لازم لازم means needs تصريح and تصريح means permits or permission إلا إلا means except ميثا ميثا يعني يعني means literally means mean but we could actually translate it to actually or literally أخت فيصل is a sister of فيصل and the guilty يطلع لازم تصريح إلا ميثا ميثا يعني أخت فيصل لا لا انا ما عندي كيك بعطيك كاش كاش لا لا انا ما عندي كيك بعطيك كاش كاش لا لا انا ما عندي كيك بعطيك كاش كاش In the last phrase that we are gonna go through is لا انا ما عندي تشيك بعطيك كاش لا انا ما عندي تشيك بعطيك كاش لا means now انا I عندي means I have but ما عندي means I don't have تشيك means check بعطيك بعطيك means I will give you as you know ب is a letter to make verbs future بعطيك I will give you cash and a cash is a cash 